Hi, it's vegan personal trainer and nutritionist Paul from Hench Herbivore, and if you want to find out how to batch cook a one pot vegan bodybuilding stew, stay tuned. This video is sponsored, but not sponsored, by my new ebook, link in the description. And let me introduce you to the fellas. Use whatever veggies you like. I've got 200 grams of kale, a couple of handfuls of mushrooms, a carrot, a red pepper, a leek. I've got 1200 grams of potatoes. I've got a can of butter beans, black beans, and chickpeas. Use whatever sort of beans or legumes you want. I've also got 80 grams of dried lentils. If you're using canned, it's one can of lentils. I've got 200 grams of quinoa. I'm also gonna use a couple of teaspoons of oregano and thyme, and I'm using this vegetable stock. We're gonna make three liters of vegetable stock. I favor this nine meals from Anarchy One. It's 75% vegetables by weight. How amazing is that? Very minimal oil. Step number one, bring three liters of vegetable stock to the boil and then simmer. Now we chop the vegetables. Rinse the legumes. You also want to rinse the quinoa. And now you simply pop everything in the pot. Cover and cook for 15, ooh, 15 minutes. Let's give this a little taste. Spud there, like a great British spud. Mm. Really hearty and warming and satisfying. Tons of protons for your protein needs. Great bit of food. Uh, I would seek to serve this with some fruit and some nuts or seeds because I'm on a bulk, I've got a lot of uh, almonds there. You know, I'll eat more nuts and seeds on the bulk, get the calories in, and I've got dried fruit, I've got dates. Were I to be on a cut, I'd simply switch this dates out for, say, an apple. I'd have a small amount of uh, almonds. Pretty much it's the same things, and we're just changing the colorant density of the foods. Anyway, I'm gonna get this lot down my neck. See you in the next video.